And let's go to the weather. John, good morning. If a dad doesn't get my joke, it's really bad. <laughs> that was a mom joke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, it is a nice day to be getting outside, hopefully for activities not like what we just saw. Uh, much more comfortable uh, in the forecast ahead of us, too, which is going to be a real good change of pace from the heat we've been in the midst of so consistently inland lately. San Jose, you're going to be right up next to 90 again today, up to 87. You're already nice and sunny. Now, we aren't going to be looking at smoke. That's staying out of the region. That's a bit of good news. We're still going to be looking at those triple-digit temperatures out towards the Central Valley, though. And lots of sunshine throughout the course of the day today is going to help those temperatures to rise pretty quickly come the afternoon. There's your triple digits from Bakersfield, Fresno, up to Sacramento and Redding. Makes our temperatures here locally not seem all so bad in comparison, but still really warm. So it's 60s and 70s near the coast and in San Francisco. That'll be nice for you. 70s and 80s along the Bay Shore isn't so bad either. Another warm one in Redwood City at 85, San Jose at 87. The 90s can be found further inland for Pleasant and Livermore and Concord. It's mid 90s. While Hayward, San Leandro, Oakland keep those 70s around. Another nice day with them. Still near triple digits in Antioch and Pittsburgh, while Vacaville at 101. Napa, Sonoma on over to Santa Rosa, all the way down to San Rafael, consistently in the 90s. Now, look ahead shows those upper 90s to low triple digits that we have at our hottest today will turn into some upper 80s to low 90s starting tomorrow, lasting through the rest of this forecast. Really nice change of pace for those of us that are just over the heat inland. Bayside from the 80s that are warmest today to just the 70s. At the coast, you'll keep those 60s consistent all the way through. Raina. John, thanks for that.